the construction and operation of buildings makes up much of the world's carbon emissions. To curb this growing problem, architects and engineers are using a natural old material in a new way. CBS's Roxana Saberi has more in tonight's Eye on Earth. At this construction site in London, you may notice something missing. We have a lot less concrete and steel here. That's because these days, architect Andrew Waugh relies almost entirely on what's called mass timber. Planks of wood glued together and stacked perpendicular to hold greater weight at higher heights. When he finished this other 10-story complex four years ago, it was the world's tallest building made of mass timber. The timber holds everything up. The brick is just to look nice. But now it's getting dwarfed by other projects from Norway to Canada and the U.S. Why use timber? It's about climate change. For us, it's about um, reducing the amount of carbon that we build with. We need to find viable alternatives to concrete and steel. For the past century and a half, steel, iron and cement have shaped our buildings. But together, they emit about 15 percent of the world's carbon. Trees, though, absorb greenhouse gases as they grow, then store them, even like this. Bamboo, so it's glued together, the small pieces. Michael Ramage is an architect and engineer from New York, researching natural materials at Cambridge University in England. And this is incredibly strong and stiff. But some environmentalists warn this timber trend could lead to deforestation. That's why Ramage says mass timber should come only from trees grown for this purpose. We can grow them sustainably uh, as long as we manage our forests well. Our buildings used to be made mainly of wood. That helped fuel the great fires of London, Chicago and San Francisco. But the U.S. Department of Agriculture says tests show that today, thick layers of mass timber can resist flames for two hours. These are six-inch solid pieces of timber. So they're less combustible? A lot less. For Waugh and other fans, mass timber is easy to use and durable. It is the future. You're pretty confident of Absolutely. that. Absolutely. No, we have no choice. I mean, climate change is, you know, is here, right? This is the most serious issue of our age. This vision may be lofty, but wooden buildings are already reaching for the sky. Roxana Saberi, CBS News, London.